Hi Virgo, welcome to your reading. How are you? This is your general love reading. I will be looking at the current energies, the energies in the near future, the person on your mind and other details. If you are new, welcome as well and I invite you to subscribe because I post videos every day. Hit the like button if this resonates with you and I will do an extended at the end of this reading as well if you are interested for some more details from the main story. Okay, let's start with this general main reading. What are the energies around you at this moment? Lots of waiting, but no progress or very, very little. Feeling very discouraged, feeling like you have wasted your time with somebody. You want to be into something long term and happy. That was your big wish, fulfillment, but you feel discouraged that it might never happen at the bottom. I see progress, in fact, you might feel a bit discouraged, but in the near future, I see some more progress, more balance, harmony within yourself, more attention from others, more potentials. Yes, the future seems much brighter, much, much optimistic. What is affecting you in your subconscious? You have desire for somebody, but you fear they are a manipulator or uh, you fear that they might not have that great passion and desire for you anymore. You are watching them, you want to know about them, but you are not talking. What was the main challenge in the past? Some rejection happened or one of you lost interest? It was a very conflictual, dramatic relationship and that is something you want to avoid in your next connection. You don't want so much fire energy that is destructive and where the communication is not good at all. In fact, what is your wish fulfillment and your hope is to build and start something really serious, to plant that seed of commitment with somebody very important. Let's see about the person that is on your mind, let's see about their energies. What are their energies? They want to make things right with you. For some of you, they might be a Libra. They want to return to make things right with you. At least this is what they feel and have on their mind. They want to say sorry. They want to communicate. They want to express some feelings. Do I see uh, very much maturity from their side? Not that much. This is a page of cups, not a king or queen of cups. But they have this general impression like this was very unsuccessful. And uh, somebody here was too much focused on themselves. This person wants to make thing, things right here. They want to try, even though they don't have expectations at all that this will lead anywhere. They think this, no matter what effort is done, it still would be very unsuccessful. They feel broken, lost, wanting to return, definitely. But where are they going? Where are they coming back? They think they are going back to a connection that still might be dramatic, heavy, and with lots of responsibilities, or one partner doing all the heavy work there, not having much cooperation with each other. Those are the energies for them. I have Libra, as I said, water signs are here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Fire, Earth, but Libra, and mostly water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What about the energies in the near future? I see some resistance around this summer season. Uh, you might be dealing with a Leo for some of you. There's a lack of communication, not too much communication, in fact, not too much action. Why is that? Why is this resistance coming? From what it is coming? Why is this? Because there's a lack of uh, confidence, having trust issues. This is the biggest problem. Uh, the suggestion here is, yes, I see you feeling a bit worried, feeling, yes, wanting to be in a connection, but you have high standards and you are thinking like a perfectionist here. 
it's not bad it is very good but in the real world there are imperfections as well and sometimes we don't know know completely or totally a person without giving them some time so start it as a friendship look at uh, the idea can you first be friends good friends with each other start it from there this is the suggestion don't cut off completely any potential that comes your way because i see pisces here i see leo and earth i'm getting this is your energy because you have been hurt in the past and you are very resistant and you don't express your feelings or why those insecurities are coming from where they are coming from this might be a challenge for the near future at the same time i see you healed recovered completely in fact this is the four of swords this is a healed person from some problems in a connection in the past so th there's no way for you to be so guarded you should be in the field it might be hard but you should give chances i think fair chances especially to people you don't know yet some of you might think this is your intuition sometimes it is your fear because i do not only have the high priestess i have the nine of wands as well it is not just intuition sometimes so don't don't just give up quickly it is your fear fear that things might go wrong in this possible new relationship that's what i'm getting here anyway if you want to know more details about you and the person on your mind the extended video is in the description box below below uh, i hope this reading was helpful don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like this video if this resonated with you i wish you all the best and i will see you at the next reading bye for now